Deck the chairs is saved after a Grinch tries to steal Christmas. Yeah, the founder says someone stole the equipment needed for some of the display lights and holiday music, mainly the tree. Fortunately, though, the light show was back on tonight. And how did that make you feel to know that this Grinch stole the computer and the ability to have the light up show here for everyone? Like the people in Whoville, uh, there are people who are going to do bad things in this world. So I would say that we just need to realize that, move on with life, do what we can do to make things joyous as we can be and uh, celebrate regardless of the circumstances. You heard of their asking the questions. Reporter Coralie Peel joining us live from Jacksonville Beach to show us how they didn't let that Grinch stop this magical Christmas experience. Coralie. Tark, you would have never known that the Grinch stepped foot here with how well tonight's light show has gone. You can see the beautifully lit up tree, the green lights here in the middle of the Seawalk Pavilion. And right inside there is where the founder says that the equipment is stolen. He says crews worked throughout the day to make sure that the Christmas magic still happened. Ask any Jacksonville Beach who that there is no place like deck the chairs around Christmas. We love it. It's an annual thing that we do with our family and it's just so much fun. We've been coming here for years and it's really grown. I mean, when we first came here, there's only a few chairs. Now look at it. It's, it's spectacular. Late Sunday night, the founder of Deck the Chairs, Curtis Loftus, says the Grinch broke into their big Whoville like tree stealing their laptop and roughly $2,000 worth of equipment, shutting down the tree lights and 10 other nearby displays. That tree has 10,000 pixel lights, so 76 straps, 10,000 lights, and they're all little computer chips in each of those lights, and they're all handled by a programmer in a program that runs 24-7. Monday night, the lights and holiday music were off. On Tuesday, the hardworking Who's rushed to restore the tree. We've had to replace the computer and the network switches and then reconnect everything, reinstall the software, reinstall the programs. Before 5 p.m., the light show and holiday music were back on, bringing the Who's joy. What do you want the Grinch to know? Oh, obviously, we're not going to let him affect deck the chairs. I mean, he can be a part of our story, but he's not going to be the end of the story. We are we're a determined group out here. So what is so special about being here? Um, everybody coming together. <laughs> As the Jacksonville Beach Hoos gathered around the colorfully lit Christmas tree, they realized the Grinch never really stole their Christmas. And you can see there's still people out here right now enjoying Deck the Chairs and the beautiful lights. At this time, it's unclear who the Grinch is, but the Jacksonville Beach Police, they are investigating this theft. And the Deck the Chairs, it's a nonprofit, so they say this theft will hurt them financially. Those wishing to donate can find their information on our website at newsforjacks.com. Reporting live from Jacksonville Beach, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.